Oh, reloading. That's a shitty time to reload. Oh, off the back of my teammate? That sucks. Tried to throw a grenade and it bounced off this dude's back. What's going on ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to another episode of Elude Star Wars playing. Today it's going to be Destiny 2 in preparation for the launch of Stadia where we will obtain the full expansions etc for Destiny 2. I wanted to get a little head start. This is the first hours. I think I played Destiny 2 a cumulative total of maybe like six hours maybe seven hours. I've uh, made a Titan Exomail. He's, uh, whatever the power rating is, uh, 762. So I just got out of, like, the starting, initial starting, uh, kind of tutorial phase. And I'm beginning to get into Destiny 2 proper, where I'm starting to do, like, the daily and weekly objectives. Uh, like the bounty hunts and stuff like that. Now, uh, those of you that, that do play Destiny 2, uh, there's the Xbox, the PC, and the PlayStation versions out currently. And uh, on PC, you got a couple options. You can either go Steam or you can actually get it off of the Blizzard launcher. I only realized it was on the Blizzard launcher after the fact, but it is free to play. So uh, yeah, it takes nothing to get started. I figured uh, since Stadia is releasing soon, I'll uh, I'll have the full Shadow Keep expansion and everything up to like all the DLC that's currently available uh, with my Stadia subscription. So. Uh, I wanted to see what the free-to-play experience was going to look like and maybe do like a side-by-side -side comparison. So I'll most likely be doing this until Stadia proper launches. I believe it's the 19th, so that's like four days away. I'm really excited to get into it and uh, kind of see what, what, what it's going to be like streaming on the new platform on, on the Stadia streaming service and all. Now, uh, I'm not sure what that means for YouTube and Twitch. Like, I still plan on posting videos and making content on, on YouTube and Twitch. And hopefully, like, maybe I was double dipping a while for, for YouTube and Twitch. I might do something like that with Stadia as well. But I still have to learn it. So keep an eye out. Um, look for a loot stalwart on Stadia whenever that releases. And, uh, yeah, bounty season. Hello, Guardian. The changing of the seasons offers many strange new opportunities. The treasures and unknown wonders await those who face our enemies and triumph over challenges that lurk in the wild. Completing bounties and challenges are due XP. Gaining XP levels up your season pass to unlock new rewards. Bounty season. This is the daily business here. I gotta complete the daily bounties from Zavala, Shox, Banshee, or the Drifter in the tower to gain XP and level up my season pass. One other thing I wanted to compare too was like what streaming it was going to be looking like. I don't know if you noticed, but uh, I don't have my graphics turned up really high right now. And uh, as far as all the textures and the frames per second and stuff like that is concerned, it's suboptimal currently the way the way my PC runs this. What's really nice about Stadia is uh, any monitor or any TV that you have in your house can become your, your uh, platform or a console. I think I just ran back to where I fast traveled from. But yeah, any of that stuff can become uh, your streaming console with Stadia. You'll have uh, your, your phones and your tablets and devices like that. Oh, okay, no, I'm still heading the right way. And then also like your TV and then even your laptop, even if you have like a Chromebook or something like that. As long as you can watch Netflix or YouTube on it, you'll be able to play games in their highest fidelity at 60 frames per second. So not their highest fidelity, but at a, a pretty high fidelity. I got to have the season pass of the Undying. So this is content currently locked to me because I'm free to play. I'll have to actually uh, purchase a season pass. And uh, all that comes with Stadia, so I'm not going to do it now, but I'll have access to it whenever Stadia releases. Alright, a loose stalwart, let's do this. This is a pretty cool ship. I want to reskin it. Uh, I need to probably purchase a skin for it in order to get it to look a little different than this. Because it looks all scratched and banged up. I got it as a reward for doing a mission uh, the other night. 
I went with the uh, the Titan because uh, he had stalwart in the description. So I was like, oh, no, you got to do it. And then it, it says something about uh, with one of his abilities, like they mentioned Vanguard. And I was like, oh, shit, the stalwart Vanguard. <laughs> so I had to be a Titan. The Titan's a tank, though. I'm pretty, uh, I'm pretty digging his, uh, I'm digging his, uh, abilities pretty well, too. See right here, Vanguard. The Vanguard. Fight for the Vanguard in strikes. <laughs> this person's name is Google Chrome. <laughs> well done, sir. Hello, miss. Can I make my ship look... I don't want my ship to look so banged up. Can we do that? This one here. I want to do something to it. How do I change... It just, I guess it just looks like that, not moddable. It says, Hawthorne gave me this old, heavily refurbished jump ship. Oh, okay. But if I do get it, I'll get these effects added. So that's what it is. The ship that I have is not moddable, so I can't add the effects that I purchased to it. Preview. Um... That one looks cool. It reminds me of my Star Citizen ship, the Vector Zero. This is pretty cool too. If I had to choose, it'd be either the Vector Zero or the Echo Zero. And I'm thinking the Vector. Standard issue, Vector class jump ship, perfect, perfect for racers and daredevils. Yeah, that one's kind of cool. Ah, I'm going to get this one. And it just costs Glimmer. And Glimmer, I've seen Glimmer drop everywhere. Thanks, lady. Let's do what we can to equip it. Ah, oh, yeah. And we'll just dismantle this one. Yes. And then let's put our mod on. So this is the default effect. This is current, currently applied. I can't even preview it. I want this one. Yes. And then shaders. Acquire. Oh, yes. Look at him. Look at that boy. Ooh, that boy savage looking. Ooh. Fantastic things. Now, the strikes have these modifiers going on with them. This has changed since the last time I've seen it. The solar singe is solar damage increased slightly from all sources. Blackout, enemy melee attacks are significantly more powerful and radar is disabled. Grenadier, grenade abilities deal more damage and recharge much faster. All right, let's do it. Uh, Vanguard strikes, launch. Let's check this ship out, see what it looks like. Ooh, look at him. Ooh, got that purple coming out the back. Yeah, that's a that's a nice that's a nice skin. That's a cool ship. Yeah. Yeah, that's cool. Here we are. There's our here's our buddy. Yes. Let's do this. I like that they let you get a ship right away. And there was my fancy transition, my little fade in. Now we we are running blackout right now, so we have no m map or way of uh checking a radar or anything. Yeah, this guy's tearing shit up. I can't even get any shots off on anything. Damn, I can't shoot anything. Here we go. That was <laughs> such a bad shot. Oh, reloading. That's a shitty time to reload. Oh, off the back of my teammate? That sucks. He ran right in front of me. Tried to throw a grenade and bounced off this dude's back. Respawning restricted. Uh oh. That's no bueno. Come get some. Ra! I get my little shield I can spawn every once in a while. Looks like my teammate died. Let's go revive him. Looks like our buddy's got him. I do notice sometimes you gotta look on the ground because there's shit that can pop up on the ground that's pretty useful to have. So it looks like we got, is that a warlock? That guy's a warlock and this one's a, that one might be a titan like I am. 
Man, my shot is off. <laughs> Dude, these little orbs. I don't know what those are. Oh, those are helping boost my special. Those are the orbs of light. So, if you get your special and you don't use it immediately, you begin generating these little orbs of light for your teammate to generate their special. I haven't got enough shots and things to, to generate my special yet. These guys are quickly killing everything. Oh, their melee damage has increased, so I gotta be careful. There's my special. My rendering isn't happening fast enough for me to keep up. Come on, reload. Look, there's a piece of gear right there. I can pick this up. And it's some boots. So that's pretty good. I think it helps knowing where things spawn too. Because you can already kind of be looking at where the creature is going to show up. If you've ran this a few times. And I unfortunately have not. We gotta get this guy. Take that wizard shield down. Wow, somebody just nuked him. Are these guys just a higher level than me? Because they're tearing shit up. Headshots matter too. You can get crits from headshots. There we go. I got a kill. Maybe that's my problem. I need to stay away from them guys so I can actually get some shit by myself. Is there friendly fire? Because I keep on shooting these guys. Not intentionally. Am I burning? Oh yeah, no. We're activating something. Thought he was going to come out around the left side there. Raga god, bitches. I need to get some finishers. Here, let's... Let's go bam this guy. Bam him. Boom. This place is kind of creepy actually. I do want to use my super. But things are dying so quickly I'm, I'm going to save it. Until we seem to be in trouble. Boom. <laughs> Superman punched him. They have finishers I can do too, if I can get close to one that's already been damaged. Pretty good grenade there. If I do say so myself. There it goes. Boom! That's that finisher. I think once that boss pops up, we'll be able to pop our our super. Boom! I got a weapon just now. Let's see what it is. 750. I like to compare them. Uh, this one gives more reload speed, more handling, more rounds per minute, but less impact. I'll hold what I got. What is this? Oh my goodness! I think I did something wrong there. <laughs> oh, whoops! Let's see what our teammates are doing. Oh yeah, they got an on, on an elevator I missed. Oh, they got all them kills too. Damn, I don't know what I'm gonna do. Hopefully it spawns me near them. I missed that elevator though. Oh, okay. It put me up here where they are. Thank you. That purple box is my heavy ammo. I uh, don't currently need that heavy ammo. Boom! Superman punch. Oh, teammate died. Let's go get him. I got you, bro. What are my teammates doing? Look like he popped his special. We gotta destroy this or what? What is he shooting? Oh, okay. <laughs> hey, hit that guy one time. 
Doo doo! I'm such a bad shot. Ah! Oh, this thing hurts. Ow! 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 Uh. Oh, this guy. Get Raga God. So that's with my heavy weapon. I only did that because I saw this here. Yay, we all made it this time. Yeah, I know, right? Rah! 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 Can I get some shots off? Damn, can't hit anything. <laughs> A lot of good that did. I thought my barrier would float onto the elevator with me. It did not. Let's get our Ram Bam Pam. Oops. That was a waste. Oh. I think I honed in on the boss when I should have killed Ads. Oh, look. Oh, I thought I was respawning. Oh no, we died. We all died. <laughs> okay, so we need to kill some ads this time. Ugh, 31 kills? Eesh. We need to do better than that. Oh cool, it started us off right here. Alright, where do the ads come from? Probably these black puddles. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fuck. Okay, so that's not the uh, strat. Oh, I'm standing in fire. Oh, God. I'm reloading! Fuck! <laughs> I switched to my main weapon, I wanted to start shooting something, but I started reloading. I forgot I left my main weapon without reloading it. Come on, revive me, brother. Yeah, thank you, thank you, thank you, come on. Yes! Yes, thank you. Season rank up, nice. The fuck is that thing? Reload, reload. I ain't making the same mistake twice. Okay. Got him. Yeah, buddy. That shit was rough. After the boss dies, you want to run around collecting as much of this shit as you can. And there's all this stuff from a chest usually. Uh, 12 orbs. I collected 12 orbs, 5 melee kills, 41 kills overall. They got 137 and 107 kills. 20 assists. Yeah, I started coming into my own more court, more towards the end, but them guys were tearing shit up. I don't even know how they did like that many. They're not much higher rank than I am. That's 757. This guy, it makes sense. He's 930. He's ranked 23 in PvP, I think that's what that meant. So yeah, that one guy carried us. But yeah guys, this is what I'm up to, this is what I've been doing. I'm gonna be playing a lot more Destiny. And uh, you're probably just gonna be seeing a lot more of these uh, strike videos on my YouTube channel. I'll go through and edit like all the live streaming stuff out and then just put like a series of Destiny strikes as episodes. 
And I'll probably be tinkering with my graphics to try to increase that frame rate because uh, I know I don't know about y'all, but for me, like that was pretty rough uh, watching that and and being able to like adjust and do stuff on the fly with uh, such a low FPS. So uh, this is my hope is like I can I can get it running and maybe even at a lower resolution. And then whenever Stadia comes out and I'm able to play the full expansions and all the DLC of Destiny 2 on it. We'll see a massive increase in performance and uh, maybe I'll get some kills along the way. <laughs> but yeah, I appreciate you guys tuning in and until next time, we'll see you guys later. Peace.